Well, hello everyone. This is Lawrence doing another Wednesday review video for the Facebook page Elton John and the Elton Knights, a Facebook page dedicated to the music of Sir Elton John and lyrics uh, and lyrics of uh, Bernie Taupin. Um, today I'm making this video of uh, a posting that was made uh, a news story that uh, Elton is. Uh, uh, heading into the studio or doing it now to create a new album, which is great. I am more a fan of, of pre-recorded uh, uh, studio uh, music than live shows. And I, I miss that part of Elton, you know, although we did pleasantly surprise have the lockdown sessions, which, uh, I think turned out fantastic. I was a little bit weary when I first heard about it, you know, but uh, it, it sounded modern and Elton was collaborating with a lot of great artists. So, you know, what will a new Elton John album sound like? I, I think it will have such uh, more modern influences. But the next question is, how does a veteran artist who's you know done with world tours promote a new studio album you know and i have an idea that i think would be great now a few weeks ago uh the rolling stones through a uh um interview with jimmy fallen um announced a um uh, upcoming album which will be released I think October 20th and they dropped a new single called Angry which has been getting a lot of buzz a lot of buzz uh, um, on the internet um, so Elton could do something like that you know interviews and um, uh, you know drop a, a song or two that would be great but here's the meat and potatoes the um, the main part of how he could promote such an album instead of just putting it out and have it die on the vine. Um, Elton could book a number of uh, uh, shows, uh, uh, you know, a number of uh, venues, s small theaters, you know, 2,000, 3,000 seat seaters, okay? And maybe book about two or three of them and he will just perform the entire album at these shows and um and the audience the the people who buy the tickets will know beforehand that they will be attending a, a show of elton will play the entire new album not um uh his um uh, his hits are his past catalog. He, Elton is spotlighting um, a new album. I think that would be great. And it would have to be an album that he would feel, Elton would feel strongly about, like, wow, I, you know, created something really special here to add to my catalog, and I want to share it with an audience. So, um, you know, get perform these at about two or three um, uh, amphitheaters or, or um, um, theaters at you know house about two three thousand people, maybe even five hundred. Who knows? And that way, Elton wouldn't have to travel throughout the world. They would be like little tiny miniature residencies. And, um, you know, the ticket buyers for these shows will, will know what to, what they are, uh, buying into. Um, and, you know, don't, don't spring it as a surprise. You know, they, they go to a show and expect to hear, uh, um, selections from Elton's catalog. No, they will know they'll just be hearing a brand new studio album. Uh, perform live. Um, 
it's sort of like you know Elton being a brand new artist and he's out uh, on on tour promoting his first album. You know, something akin to that. Um, this album by Joe Jackson, Big World, was recorded live. It was all new material recorded live uh, in front of an audience, you know, of course, uh, with instructions to the audience, don't applaud between songs, applaud after the, the, the concert, after the performance. But, uh, you know, Elton should just record the album the traditional way and, um, and then feature it at these shows. And if it goes well, if the audience, uh, uh, responds well, then as an encore, he could do two or three of his classics, you know. So I think that would be great. And this wouldn't take a lot of time um, away from um, his retirement, something he can do in a matter of weeks. You know, he would have to get band a band together, a little rehearsing, and but they... Elton always fast at things, you know, and um, heck, I remember when the diving board came out and uh, Wonderful Crazy Nights, uh, Elton was performing uh, live versions of, of the song from those albums, uh, you know, soon after, you know, so that, that would be great. Also, perhaps the shows could be taped and put on... Um, um, YouTube on on the internet as another form of promotion. So, you know, Elton should look at what the Stones are doing as far as promotion, and um, they I gotta you know do something to promote this a new album. Just can't just record it, put it out there, and it will die on the vine. You know, I gotta do something. So that's my suggestion with the shows. Um, so I like to know what you think, you know, um, you know, Elton's in his, uh, mid seventies now, um, or little later seventies and, you know, it's wear and tear on the body to these big world tours, but the series of, um, um, smaller venue shows just to feature the album, uh, as a promotion vehicle, for the new album, I think it would be great. And Elton would be offering something new, something different to his audience at his show. So anyway, that's my idea. I look forward to a new Elton John studio album. I know Bernie been wanting him to um, do one for some time. And congratulations to Bernie on his new book. I look forward to reading it. Thank you for watching, and I like to know your thoughts, so uh, please uh, post them. Bye-bye.